I'm here in Princess Street Gardens uh, in the shadow of Edinburgh Castle to visit a statue of a Polish war hero. It's not this guy standing behind me, but him, Wojciech, the Polish war bear, a Syrian brown bear uh, who was, ended up joining the Polish army and helped them out in battle. In 1942, the Polish army in the east was en route to Tehran when on a rest stop, a number of troops came across a young Iranian boy with an orphaned bear cub. The troops purchased the bear and he was reared in a refugee camp over the next few months before being donated to what would become the 22nd Artillery Supply Company, where his name Wojtek. It would turn out to be an apt name as it roughly translates as smiling or joyful warrior. He was initially fed condensed milk from an old vodka bottle before moving on to fruit, marmalade and honey. The vodka bottle is thought to have given him his taste for beer, which he was sometimes given as a reward, but don't worry, he was a happy drunk. He was also known to smoke cigarettes and would playfully wrestle with other soldiers more often than not winning, but never hurting anyone in the process. As his regiment moved through to Palestine to board the British transport to eventually reach the Italian front, they were told the British army wouldn't accept pets, so they did the obvious thing and officially drafted them into the Polish army as a private. He was taught to salute and even given a ration book and wage and would later rise to the rank of corporal. His finest hour came in Italy, where our numerous sources report that he helped carry ammunition during the Battle of Monte Cassino and didn't drop a single crate. This led to an image of him carrying the artillery shell, becoming the emblem of the 22nd Artillery Supply Regiment. After the war, he, along with the rest of his company, were moved to Berwickshire in the Scottish borders before retiring to Edinburgh Zoo. He'd be visited by former comrades who would throw him cigarettes, which he would eat as no one was there to light them. He died in 1963, aged 21, and this statue is just one of many memorials to Wojciech, the Polish war bear. Now that the elections are over, I'm going to be doing a wider variety of videos, more or less on anything I find interesting, particularly around Edinburgh. If you know of any piece of uncommon knowledge that you'd like to share with the world, email me at keithjcvideos at gmail.com and also like and subscribe and all that stuff.